Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. So today we're going to do a very short video on how you can grab DCS Retribution preview builds. A little bit of a tutorial. So the first thing that we need to know is that you have, there are two prerequisites. One is that you need to have a GitHub account, which is absolutely free. So when you go to github.com, you'll want to click on sign up if you don't already have an account. And then the next thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to log into that account. Um, that's it. That's all you have to do in order to get access to these things. Next thing that we're going to do is you're going to want to navigate to the DCS Retribution GitHub page. I'm putting it in the link, uh, the link in the video description below, um, but it's right here, and we've already navigated here. Once you get to the uh, DCS Retribution GitHub repository page, you'll see all of this information. There's a couple of things that I want to point out. The first is is that you can join their their Discord. Um, through clicking this link here. Um, if you do that, uh, there are folks that can help you with anything. If you do run into issues, if you have ideas for improvements, absolutely can, can provide that here. And um, typically, you know, folks will, will uh, get back to you very quickly. Uh, other thing is that there's a documentation in Wikipedia, or I guess like a, a wiki that you can use to, to look at different things. Um, so in order to get preview builds, very straightforward. We're just going to click on this actions button at the top here. From here, you're going to see a bunch of commits. Um, and so these are the things that have been pushed into uh, the different pull request pull requests that have been pulled into uh, DCS retribution. What we're going to want to do is we're going to click on the first green one. So I typically will avoid anything with a red X because that usually means that there was some sort of an issue. Um, typically they get sorted out pretty quickly, but, um, but we're going to click on this green one here. And this is actually the build that I was using in our previous video. And you'll see that everything is green, everything is happy. Um, and we'll scroll down here till we get to artifacts. And this is the actual build of DCS Retribution. This is an alpha build. So we'll go ahead and click on this. It's gonna start downloading. So we'll open up our downloads folder where I downloaded it. I'm gonna go ahead and right click and extract all. Do the same thing again. This is a weird little quirk that uh, GitHub has. We'll go ahead and once we've done this the second time, um, that's that should be all of the files. So we'll fast forward here just so you don't have to watch it extract. All right, so we just got the last one extracted. I'm gonna go ahead and rename this folder here. And I'm just gonna put alpha at the end of it. Just so I know, we're going to just go ahead and move this directly into my desktop. I can open it up. And from here, you have everything that you're already familiar with as it pertains to retribution. We can go ahead and right click, and just go ahead and run it. And there you have it. This is the preview build uh, that we just downloaded and it's already loaded in what I was playing earlier uh, because save compatibility is is usually not broken on these builds as well and we're able to kind of go from here so if there's any questions by all means ask them in the uh, the comments section happy to respond and if you run into any other issues I highly recommend checking out the DCS retribution discord um, and asking questions there as well so thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.